Hey, YouTube folks. Today, let's get into a heartfelt update from the one and only The Little Couple E star, Jen Arnold. She shared a personal disappointment on her social media, highlighting a real lack of inclusivity that left her quite shaken. Curious about the details? And how did her awesome fans react? Stick around as we peel back the layers of Jen's experience and witness the tremendous support from her fan base. Ready? Let's jump right into it. Jen's no stranger to using her social media to raise awareness about dwarfism. Whenever Dwarfism Awareness Day rolls around, you can bet she's there educating her followers. With her platform, she tackles important topics, shedding light on various disabilities and motivating others. Plus, as a pediatrician, she's got the know-how to back it up. So, picture this, on a recent Friday evening, Jen took to her Instagram to share a candid moment with fans. She'd given a pedicure a shot, you know, a chance to unwind. But guess what? A lack of inclusivity hit her like a speed bump. Speaking her mind, the former TLC star expressed, feeling let down by at Minilux at hashtag Chestnut Hill. No way to access the lower floor where pedicures happen, no elevator. Important to let disabled customers know, so they don't end up charged if they can't make it. Now, even though the experience wasn't great, she did give kudos to the staff. But hey, they might not be the ones to handle refunds, and an elevator might be out of their hands too. In the comments, fans poured in, sharing their disappointment about the whole situation. A lot of folks empathized with her, and some found it a bit odd that inclusivity seems lacking even in 2023. One fan chimed in, did they seriously charge you for not taking the stairs? Not cool. You can report it on ADA.gov for a disability rights violation. Others joined in, encouraging her to take action. Some even went that extra mile, hitting up the nail salon's Instagram to call for more inclusivity and an apology to Jen. With over a million followers, Jen's voice could really take this story far. Here's to hoping that things get sorted out and Jen's experience brings some much-needed change. So, what's your take? Were you as surprised as we were about Jen's inclusivity hiccup? Share your thoughts in the comments, we're all ears. And hey, a thumbs up and a subscribe wouldn't hurt for more updates. Catch you next time.